Hi, hi guys, my name's Schmitty and I'm back with another kiting episode for you guys today. Today I did go Magician, it was on live stream. Joggy, uh, one of the best magicians in the server, challenged me to go Magician and I don't, you know, I'm, I'm going to take any challenge. Unfortunately, I do run into the Ripper here. I used to play Magician somewhat in Season 1, 2, and 3, but I was a coordinator main. He has a really good Foggy here, I should have dodged it, but that was a really good Foggy by Ender Trance. I used a speed boost here. I know I have two ones, so I have a little escape plan, but my goal right now, throw this pallet down, make him break it. When he breaks it, I transition, as you guys know. Once the hunter breaks that pallet, I transition. And I know if I get to ruins, I'll be safe. So right here, I'm gonna to try to get to ruins. He foggies. I dodge the foggy. I have a wand, so I'm gonna use it now, and I go to this window to get the speed boost. And I'm just going to play around here. I'm not, again guys, I'm not a Magician main. I haven't played Magician in maybe five seasons. This is the first time I've played Magician in a while. But these wands really do go clutch. I know he would try to Foggy Blade me here, so I'm just playing Ring Around the Rosie. He Foggy Blades me here, so I use my Illusion to block the Foggy. He blinks. Luckily, he misses it. I Vault the Pallet, and I am, I'm gone. So I know he wasted Blink. He has no ability. I know he doesn't have Peeper. I know he doesn't have Teleport. He does end up, I want to see this, he does end up foggying the, I'm just, I'm just playing with him, but he does end up foggying the robot here. It was a good foggy. That was a, that was a pretty good foggy. But I know he does not have any more ability, but he does have presence, so he is invisible. So I'm just going to try to get to this pallet here. He misses the foggy again. Now I'm just gonna play him in runes. Runes is so good against Ripper. You just keep going. And unfortunately, I do run into him. I thought usually hunters when you vault the uh, when you vault the window they they chase you, but he 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 um, predicted me and kept going. Spencer stuns here to extend my kite. And right now I'm just trying to get the hospital. I do end up dodging a foggy blade as going in the hospital. He almost hit that foggy boy too. I run towards him because he I, I thought he would know that I might go back, which I would have died if I went back. So I knew the speed boost would help me out there. It would help me dodge that hit. I throw this pallet down. I know he doesn't have foggy because he wasted it. Now he does have foggy, but it doesn't matter. I'm just going to take the regular hit. And I die in a pallet. I die in a pallet. Why? Because Sprinter's there. I know Sprinter can stun for me. So I just die in this sweet juicy pal for Sprinter. Let's watch, let's watch. Unfortunately it's not a quick down, but uh, I, a stun's a stun, right? It's wasting time. I contained the hunter for 120 seconds. Keep in mind this is the first time I've played Magician in like five seasons. Sprinter does another good stun. But yeah, I've played I played Magician like I played it pretty well in my opinion against a top hunter like Endertron, so he's on a, a top team EM too, so I thought I played fairly well. And the cipher is primed. So I end I did end up three cipher kiting. Sprinter's stunning allowed me to five cipher kite. I'm not gonna take the credit of the five cipher kite without crediting Sprinter. Because the last, you know, minute of the game was me just getting flopped to the ground after a stun. But the time I did kite, I think I did fairly well. The early foggy blade I could have improved on, but I think I did fairly well. The cipher is primed. And I actually don't know what happens here. I think he foggy someone and then someone just... That was a good foggy. Sprinter hid behind the wall, that was actually pretty smart. But that Ripper speed boost. Oh, he wasted blink. That was a good foggy. Andrew Trent is not a bad Ripper, guys. Um, he, he hits almost all foggies, but yeah, guys, that is my kite. This is a shorter video, only about five minutes. Um, I've been recording, yeah, for about five minutes. But yeah, I just want to show you guys that you can use different characters that aren't meta and still kite with them. If you want to go Mind's Eye, go Mind's Eye. If you want to go Magician like I did, go Magician. It's fun to play with these characters, the old season uh, 
early season characters. It was fun for me to throw that back. I did have fun kiting. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you are new, please subscribe. And leave in the comment section down below what characters you'd like to see next on the channel. I did go Magician because I was challenged. If you challenge me to go a character that isn't Wildling, I will gladly take you up on that offer. Anyway, guys, have a great day, great night. Wherever you are, stay safe. Bye-bye, guys.